Hello guys, I welcome you to Vimes Projects Limited, where we design and build classic homes. Okay, we are still on Pi Foundation. This is episode four, where we'll be talking about Pi caps. What is actually Pi cap? Pi cap is actually a structural element. It is a mass of concrete that it is used to bind the pipes together. You know, they bind the pipes together that will help you to transfer the load from the superstructure to the pipes. So we can actually we mostly use these uh, pipe caps for uh, deep foundations like the pipe that we have. It helps to bind one, two or more, you know, pipes together. By binding two or more together, it helps to you know reduce the stress, you know, from the individual you know pipes. Yeah, by transferring or distributing these loads evenly. So it will help to distribute the loads directly to the ground. That's actually the main reason why we are using pi, uh, this pi cap. And now this pi cap it came from the design of the structural engineer. The structural engineer gave us this design. So we have a different, we have a 900 mm height for the pi cap, and there are different shapes of this pi cap. You know, we have the square type, we have the rectangular type, we have different shapes. So these different shapes will be using a 16 mm reinforcement on the pi reinforcement then it is also where your columns from the building will start from this from the pi cap that is where we'll start inserting the columns for the main foundation so we'll be showing you guys the process that we are taking to do that and part of the process that we'll do is to excavate the ground we can't do it without excavating the ground because of the nature of the the land that we have here it is uh, it's not a table land it's undulating a little bit so we have to excavate you know to get a level place so we can do our blinding so that is where the pie cap can rest on so so far so good we've started the excavation already <laughs> the whole site is almost filled up with troubles because as we are excavating we are breaking the pie heads so as we are breaking the pie heads a whole lot of things are going on so it even makes it more interesting it makes it more interesting so we'll be showing you guys the step-by-step -step process and method that we do to achieve you know this uh, pie cap so from the pie cap we will be able to insert our columns and do the final casting for the pie cap so now another thing we are doing on this pie cap we won't you know since because of the nature of the ground we are supposed to bind the pie cap and the rough beams together but because of how the site the site conditions now we are excavating and casting so that we can backfill these spike caps so what we'll be doing is on the reinforcement we won't cast to 900 as recommended we will reduce it a bit so that we'll have a space where the raft beams can connect to so that because there has to be connections you know between the pie cap and the raft beam so we we'll have to leave that little space so that by the time we finish up with the casting of the pie cap we'll have that space to connect our beams then before we can do the final thing so guys i want you guys to keep on with us just keep following us we'll lead you through this whole process so that you understand how we do these things on site because the idea behind all these things is to let you know what we do and how we do that that will give you a conviction that we are all about quality and we'll give you the best results in your building project so stay glued to us we appreciate you guys keep on watching keep on following if you have any question you can drop it on the comment section we love you guys and just continue to be with us. Thank you very much. God bless you.